What up? It's your boy, LD Vlogs. Back in the back in the booth. Back to speak some truth. I just came from a pretty important meeting with my entire company. Not my company, but you know, the company that I'm a part of that I contribute to. And you know, gotta get it off my chest again, but yeah. I am contributing to it in a few ways, but I need to contribute to it from a dollars and cents perspective. That's really the big deal. But the one epiphany that I had is that everyone's doing their best. You know, as, as I looked around the entire company, looked around the entire room, I saw and I heard about all these organizational changes that were happening across the business. And I thought about my leaders, how much they have to juggle, how much they have to balance. It takes a lot to be a manager. It takes a ton to be a leader. That anyone that's a manager, they first have had to kill it as being an individual contributor. And then once they become a manager, they're responsible for the success of others. And they also have to manage so much when it comes to delivering on their individual goals, managing the emotions of their team, and also managing the organization and how it functions. It's another level to be a manager. So for me to be an IC and to, to be having a hard time, you know, I have a long way to go in my career. There's a lot of times where I feel like I have a lot of pressure on my name. Lawrence, Dong, you know, just having law on my name and having a foreign last name. So I'm not trying to have pity on myself anymore. Like I am who I am, it is what it is. And I just think about my, my company. I think about my leaders and I look across the room and I saw like everybody trying to do their best. Everybody prioritizing what's important to them. Everybody on their grind. I need to stop being an observer and I need to be a worker. I need to be a contributor. I need to be a real value add to the business. My God, I, I'm just one man. I'm doing one man's job and I have a number to hit for the year. And that's all I'm trying to do is to hit my number, hit my goals and continue existing at the company. Like it's at the start of the year, somebody on the team already closed six hundred thousand dollars. Last year, my buddy closed a million and a half dollars. My other friend, she closed a two hundred fifty thousand dollar deal at the end of the year. You know, I'm I'm making good money here, but I have to make my worth. I'm not here to cry to you. I'm not here to complain. I'm just here to share my journey where I, where I am. I have five accounts and I need to think about how to crack into each of them. The other thing is I only have three months. I need to think about it as if I don't close a deal in three months, I'm going to get kicked out of the company. It's, this kind of business is, is, I'm living on the edge, you know, I'm living on the bleeding edge of Silicon Valley and leaving, leaving, living on the edge of the country, Silic the, the center of technology. A lot of big things are happening. So, you know, I also know, like, when I come to vlog, I gotta show you guys more about like what's going on in my life. Maybe I do some mukbangs, mukbangs. I don't know what it is, but like. I also wonder, like, is there more to life than just this job, going to sleep and going to work, spending time with my wife, just kicking in the apartment? Like, I don't want to be an NPC, you know? I don't want to keep playing that. I want to find my own zone. I want to find my own role. break out of it through chain, you know. I'm grateful to be here and I've really been trying to keep a smile on my face the entire day. Like I'm not 
really like an attractive guy, I think, but hopefully I could be more attractive. I, got, I wish I could just be pulled out of normalcy. I don't want to be a celebrity. I just want to be well off. I want to be able to get a full night's sleep every day, like 10, 11 hours of sleep from the time I go to, go to close my eyes to when I wake up. But then I want to focus on like two or three important things that really address what I'm looking to achieve and then go from there. try my best and at this point I'm optimistic I'm going to succeed I have two opportunities in this quarter that I hope by the end of next week I'll have a real sense of whether or not it will close this quarter and God willing they will LD Vlogs out. I'll show y'all more content. Peace.